what qualities do you feel you have that will make you a great Miss Universe? Oh. Hello everyone! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. At kung di ka pa nakakapag-subscribe sa YouTube channel ko, ano pang ginagawa mo? Mag-subscribe ka na! And for today's video, ating i-review ang mga sagot ni Rabia Mateo sa Beauty Talks ng Misosology. I'm very excited for this, so let's begin! So sa vlog na ito, naghanda kami ni Carlo ng mga scores. Ng mga scores for uh, Rabia uh, in her answers mamaya. So i-rate namin si Rabia from 1 to 10. Pero feeling ko hindi naman naaabot ng ano ng uh, lower than 5. Yes. Si Rabia. So parang hindi ko na kailangan na tatog 1 to 4. Yes, guys. So 10 is the highest. And one is the lowest score na pwede nating ibigay kay Rabia. Ating papanoorin yung um, segment ng misosology na this or that. Let's watch it first. Would you rather change the past or see the future? I'm not perfect. And I would choose something that I can change my past. Because I know it's hmm. going to affect my present and my future. Ako muna. Uh, For so, me, it's A. Mm -hmm. It's simple and concise. Tapos, sabi niya doon, I'm not perfect, pero I would choose to to change the past. So, parang nakulangan ako sa sagot niya doon. Ako, for me, it's 10 because it's concise and yung tanong naman, hindi siya na humihingi ng masyadong explanation because it's only about Choosing one, which is one, which is better. Changing the past will impact her on her future. I get that point of Rubia on her answer. So that's why I gave her a 10. So... It's better than the answer to her. Okay. Be loved or be respected? They go hand in hand, but I choose to be respected because that is the best expression of love. If you are going to ask that same question, be loved or be respected? <laughs> same. Be respected. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's also love. Eh, pag you respect the tao. Ang galing ni Rubia because um, after ng tinanong, meron na siya agad na iisip. Uh, it's a tough question because they are uh, almost almost the same. But Rubia perfect her answer on that specific question. So, for me, I will give her another 10. Yeah, because uh, if you respect somebody, uh, it means that you love that, some, that someone or somebody Sa akin, 10 din. Pakopya na lang din ang sagot ko. <laughs> yeah, so, so na lang ang galing, ang galing, ang galing ni Rodia. More time or more money? I don't need a lot of time in this world, but I feel like I need to have a lot of money. <laughs> because I have a lot of things that I need to sustain. <laughs> My family, for example. Nakatuwa, you know, yes. And I, I don't aspire for eternal life, you know. I, I, I'm not a vampire, but I need something that I can extend to other people. And they say that happiness is something that cannot be bought by money. But if you're yeah. gonna use the money in in the best possible way, then you can extend help and share that happiness to others. Okay. Tama nga naman yung sagot niya. She choose uh, money kasi syempre, alam naman natin si Rabia na uh, galing din naman siya sa, hindi naman karangya ang pamilya. So, on that particular uh, Q&A, I would uh, give her 10 again. Yeah, so for me naman, I will give her 9. Uh, because, para sa akin naman, I would like to have more time so that I can be rich, diba? If we don't have enough time, how can you be rich? 
That's just my personal opinion. Anyway. Bigyan na natin yung ano, yung uh, benefit of a doubt kay, <laughs> kay Rabia. Kasi syempre, tawag nun, hindi naman, siguro hindi naman yung naranasan yung maginhawang buhay. Kasi nga, di ba, natin natin yung istorya ng buhay niya. Rabia is practical. Oh, and, practical siya. Yes. Practical yung answer niya. Because din that's the reality. That's the reality. That we need money to sustain us. Oh, okay. Kaya tawag din naman kung if I were choose between um, money and time, I would rather choose money talaga. Mm-hmm. Kasi it would bring you um, happiness. Yeah. Totoo rin naman. May point rin naman sa Rebia. Because how can you enjoy life? How can you enjoy your time here in this world kung wala kang money? How can you travel? How can you eat delicious foods? Yes. Diba? So I get the point of her video. Yes, so let's move to the Q&A. So yun yung kanina was just a... Uh... Patikin. <laughs> um, cosmetic surgery is considered an elephant in the room in pageant. It happens, but if talk about, it is usually frowned upon. Should we be more open and accepting about this? What are your thoughts or opinion on this? We live in a conservative country, that's why it's very hard to have a talk about cosmetic surgery because other people are still holding back from this topic. But I think that we need to be more open about this one because we shouldn't shame women for choosing what is best for their bodies. If you are a woman and you wake up in the morning and you look at the mirror and you say, I love myself, I won't change anything about myself, then that's okay, we're happy. We're celebrating with you. But do not shame a woman who feels insecure and would choose to do some cosmetic surgery just to improve her confidence. We need to be with her. We need to support her in choosing what is best for her body. And I hope that Filipinos would have more um, a- an open heart and an open mind in talking about this issue because this is really happening. This is the reality of life. Oh oh, very then, good. At the end very of the day, answer. at the end of the day, buhay 'yon ng isang tao. Wala tayong pakialam sa kanya. Yes. Kung gusto man niyang uh, magpadagdag sa katawan niya, okay lang buhay niya 'yon, 'di ba? As long as may money siya at yes. doon siya mag, mag makakahanap ng happiness sa buhay niya. Yes, we have to respect if magpapa surgery siya because we have so many insecurities. We have to oh, admit that. Mm-hmm. And if you have the money, sino ka? Sino ka para pigilan siya? Yes. So, in that particular uh, question to Rabia, I would give her a perfect score of 10. Again. Ako din, I like her answer. And ang bilis talaga niyang mag-sumagot. Ang bilis talaga niyang sumagot. Kung baga pagkabigay pa lang ng question, hindi na siya nag-iisip. Uh-huh. And her answer came from her heart. Kasi nasa puso hindi, niya. Hindi naman sa hindi siya nag-iisip, pero mabilis mag-process sa uh-huh. utak niya. Uh-huh. Sa bago. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Tama, tama. Kung baga, sinasabi pa lang, ina-absorb na, 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 na ng, ng, ng brain niya yung question, tapos right after matapos nung, ano, nung question, may sabot na siya agad. Totoo. And that's the reason why I really like her. Ako din, 10. 10 din ang aking score for Bia because uh, I, I also agree with her opinion about cosmetic surgery oh. because sino nga ba tayo para para i-judge yung isang tao if she likes um, or he likes diba to change a part on his body diba kahit ako naman kahit diba gusto natin kuminis kailangan natin ipa surgery gusto <laughs> palitan na tayo mapapalitan na tayo kung may pera ka why not but for now wala tayong pera <laughs> anyway um Yan, yan ang, ang galing galing, ang galing ni Rebia. Her answer came from her heart and uh, malaman yung sinasagot ni Rebia. So let's proceed to next. A woman has just awakened after being asleep for 20 years. What do you tell her she missed? Oh, I would say that she missed a lot of things. But I would like to focus on the aspect of technology. I would want to inform her that with one just click, you can connect yourself to the world. But it had its disadvantages. And one of them is that, yes, it connects you from different people, but it disconnects you from reality. 
And I want her to realize that things are so much different now because people are starting to be mean, to be entitled about their opinions on life. And it mm-hmm. divides us individually and as a nation. And I hope that this changes. And I hope that she also does her effort to be a good citizen, not just somebody who just speaks out of the mouth. Totoo yung sinabi niya. People are so mean and entitled <laughs> ngayon. On <Online>. marami. <laughs> <laughs> Meron to mention. Meron to mention. <laughs> Pero sa totoo, sa true naman no, oh, tama yan naman siya. Oh, parang perfect ten na, na, na naman ulit. Ewan ko ba, um, satisfied lahat ako sa mga ta- sa mga answers niya eh. As in malaman siya tapos tawag noon pagkatanong sagot agad kasi Uh, process again sa sa brain niya yung ano yung question so I'll give her another ten on that particular uh, question. Mm-hmm. Saka yun, yun talaga yung pinaka uh, the best answer for for this question kasi uh, before wala pa naman tayong technology. Technology yeah. Uh-huh. And yun yung talaga unang papasok sa isip mo na and also maganda din na na brought up ni Rabia yung about being Uh, in feeling entitled ng mga mm-hmm. ng mga tao niya pwedeng ngayon. sabihin na ano na tawag niya ito about education <laughs> <laughs> ano yung progress <laughs> education the same same lang din naman oo sa kay Terbia hindi kasi siya yung parang usual na mga sagot di ba kasi yung mga pageants may mini memory silang mga sagot mm-hmm. kumbaga kumbaga ready made na mm-hmm. so so Terbia kasi hindi siya ganon kung ano yung kung ano yung nasa puso niya yun yung bigang mga binibitawan ng mga uh, uh, sagot tulad ng ano ng isang candidate ng ano ng representative ng ibang bansa minelemora isang sagot dating sagot ni Katrina <laughs> napaka copycat mo girl <laughs> oo so kailangan din kasi ng authenticity di ba kailangan natin ng authenticity sa mga kayo. beauty pageants so kailangan may own way of answering the question kahit hindi yung parang gumagaya ka sa ibang tao totoo So, anong score mo doon? Ang score ko doon ay 10. Okay. Good. Okay, 10. Pero, um, wait lang. Babawiin ko siya. Bibigyan ko siya ng 9. Kasi medyo may part doon na magulo siya for me. Na imbes na parang hindi siya naging concise. Parang umaga umikot yung kanyang answer. So, I'll give her 9 for that. But, it, it was a good answer. So, let's proceed with the next What qualities do you feel you have that will make you a great Miss Universe? Oh. The best quality that I have that makes me somebody who can touch other people's heart is that I stand free of myself. I am an open book and I would always share the hardships, the experiences, the knowledge that I have in the past. And It's all about giving back and paying forward to your community. And I have the heart for that. The heart to live the legacy of service, compassion, and excellence. Wow. Amazing. So, uh, napaka-brief ng sagot niya. Pasok siya sa 30 seconds <laughs> na ano. <laughs> <laughs> na binibigay na ano na binibigay during Miss Universe uh, alawa one time sa ano sa Miss Universe I think bilis mag-process ng isip niya so for me I will give her 10 for that at kung mapapansin niyo siguro no sa pinakauna niya yung sagot pansinin mo mamaya yung binibigay niya yung sagot nag-i-introduce mo na siya o kaya nagbibigay niya yung situation and then ina-elaborate niya and then sa dulo nagbibigay siya ng conclusion Conclusion. niya. Kung baga parang may hierarchy siya. Oo, may may ano siya, may parang, anong tawag (laughs) nun? Or, kung hindi man conclusion, nagbibigay siya ng solution. Hmm. Or call for action. I think it's the uh, best way to answer a question because sa isang question kasi, or sa isang argument, kailangan mo ng cons... uh, ng antag na ng four hindi siya ng higher hindi siya hierarchy eh one eternity later may outline okay, ayon yeah, okay. dapat sa isang sagot may outline ka so kailangan may introduction ka and or citing the situation and then the body which is the explanation of your answer or elaboration of your answer and then sa pinakalas is conclusion kung hindi conclusion solution or 
um, call for action. Tama. I think yun yung ginagamit ni Rabia. Yun yung strategy na ginagamit ni Rabia sa kanyang mga answers. And I think yun din yung gagamitin niya sa Miss Universe. Mara, mara. Oo. Oh, oh. oh. So, I'll give her another 10 again. Mm-hmm. So, yun. Let's proceed to the next one. Up next. Do you think that staying positive at all times will help you get through certain situations? What if it gets toxic? We have this idea which is being called the toxic positivity. 